Hey guys, welcome back to Mo Vapes. Today we're doing our first official review in the Vape Collective store. So I know I said I'm going to be doing a video a week, but this last week has been quite busy trying to sort out some stuff. So unfortunately, I didn't have time to make a video and upload. I apologize for that. But we're here today. Let's take a look at what we have. So at the moment, this is all the craze. It's called an elf bar. It's a disposable vape. The one that I have here is 2,500 puffs, and it's a strawberry ice flavor. Now, I have to say, guys, when I first got this, it took me a while to get used to it because it's 50 milligrams of nicotine, which is quite a lot. Uh, but after that, the flavor is actually quite good on these. I'm not going to lie. So if we look at the top, we have our drip tip, our mouthpiece, not drip tip. And at the bottom, we have four small holes. That's going to be your battery life indicator. This is not rechargeable, guys. So it's just going to be white all the time. And once it starts flashing white, that means the battery is dead and the device is done. So if you look here at the corner, we have a small hole there as well. That's going to be our airflow. So a nice tight mouth to lung of this. It's actually quite an enjoyable vape, not gonna lie. So today what we're actually doing is what's inside a disposable vape. So let's take a look how we're gonna get this done. Let's try just popping it open. Okay, we're getting somewhere. And there we go. Okay, so the first thing we see is it's like a cotton donut. Looks to be a cotton donut with some e juice that's being soaked into it. Okay. And next up, we have a rubber gasket. Let's see if we can remove that and see what's under it. Okay, so I have my Coil Master screwdriver here. We're just going to see if we can pop that gasket out. And there we go just as easy as that okay and it looks like we have what seems to be sponge i'm assuming if this is soaked in e-liquid as well so um, i'm basically going to be destroying this because it can't be used again and it's not going to be used again so let's get out the big gun Alright, so let's see if we can pull that sponge out and see what it looks like. Okay, so pulling out the sponge, it looks like this as well is soaked in e-liquid. So that looks like where your way is going to be stored. There's no actual uh, loose liquid stored in this. And then what do we have here? Okay, that's just a plastic tube. And if we look inside, this it looks to be that's our heating element. Okay, so let's pop this out. Okay, that's a cover. And yeah, guys, that looks to be our coil in there and some cotton. Okay. Oh, actually, sorry guys, it's not cotton, it's like a sponge, actually. No, no, it is cotton, it is cotton. Sorry about that, guys. Okay, let's pop that out. Oh, we're unwrapping our coil. Okay, and there we have it. So there's another rubber gasket at the bottom and this looks to be our battery and our light indicator that I was telling you about guys. Alright, so let's see if we can find the coil or did we unwrap the coil. Oh, 
Yeah, guys, it looks like we have unwrapped the coil by mistake. Uh, so sorry about that, but uh, it's just a standard round wire coil. Feels very thin. Um, that's going to be about it for that. And we do have something else in here. I don't know if you guys will be able to see that. Look to be, there we go, something else in there. So let's try and get that out. Okay, the pipe is too big. Screwdriver it is. Uh, this just seems to be some sort of adhesive strip. Okay, so. Oops. <laughs> okay, so that's our bottom cap. And this is just now an empty tube. So guys, uh, that's going to be it for today's video. As you can see, this it's pretty simple. It's just your battery pack, coil, cotton, LED light indicator, and your liquid is stored in a sponge. So that's going to be it for today's video, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did enjoy it, please leave a like and comment down below. It really helps a lot. And if you're not subscribed, please feel free to subscribe to us. We are at 40 subscribers at the moment, hoping to get to 50 very, very soon. All right, guys. So this is Mo Vapes signing off. See you in the next one.